Welcome to online classes. We have <coughs> discussed the chapters of third chapters of the current electricity of the twelfth class. In the previous lecture, we have studied. In the previous lecture, we have discussed how the basic circuits can be solved here. How the basic circuits can be solved here. So we have to take it as another example. Of the basic circuit. This is the simple circuit that is to be using here. Suppose this is a simple circuit. This is the resistance of three ohm. This is battery of the four volt. This is battery of the five volt. This is six ohm. We have to introduce it. Now we have to introduce Kirchhoff voltage now and Kirchhoff current now. The Kirchhoff voltage now we are simply using to simply say that in a closed loop, Kirchhoff's voltage now. Because all the basic circuits of electricity that can solve by the Kirchhoff voltage law. The Kirchhoff voltage law says that the potential drop, the potential drop across all the of and product of voltage, product of current and resistance. In a closed loop, closed loop is always The algebraic the algebraic sum of the algebraic sum of potential drop across the cell and product of current and resistance in a closed loop is always zero. We are simply using this concept. And second point. This is the law, and the second point we have to remember here. This law is based on based on energy conservation. Energy conservation. So now we have to see. This is minus and this is plus. Current I is going in this direction. This is positive and this is negative. This is positive and negative. But current is going in this direction and this is positive and negative. So we are doing using the loop law. This is the direction we have to rotate in this manner. Apply it. The chalk voltage law. In loop number one. So we have to write the plus five after minus four minus of three and current is I and this is minus six into I and this is equal to zero. We are simply moving from here and. The sign which is after that is to be taken in here. That is to be plus. And battery is of five volt. And we are moving from here. The next element is this. And this is minus. Our sign is minus four. And the sign after here minus. This is the resistance of three ohm. And the current is minus five. 
and after that the resistor is again coming here and taking the minus sign because in the last this negative sign is coming here and resistor of 6 and the current is right and we move in a closed loop then summation of all the circuit will be 0 simply we use solve this this is 1 minus 9i is equal to 0 so 1 by 9 is equal to i and i is equal to 1 by 9 over here so here we have to simply use the switch of our tail now in this pattern so we have to solve by this pattern by switch of our tail because the job voltage law is applicable for all the basic electrical circuits and we have to solve this is the basic procedures we have to solve of any circuits that is to be applied in the electrical circuits so we have to solve it in these manners this is the basic concept and how we apply it then we learn here this is the direction of the rotation because when we are moving from here we are moving in this direction this is the loop direction and that the numbering is also considered because here the only loop, one loop is considered. In the questions, there are two and three loops can be considered.